I'll take these pens too. So everything is craftable. Everything can be taken. So like even this lamp can be taken. All these computers, for example, you can break them, right? And you can take all their parts and all their parts turn into things. Oh dear. I don't feel right at all. Oh shit, 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 shit. I'm glad I got my hazmat suit with me. Do I have any pills? I do not have any pills. Fuck. So there's uh, events that happen too. So what's going on right now is a hazardous thing. So now I am vomiting because uh, too much radiation got into me because I didn't notice it right away. I'll just drop this for now. So I'm going to need to get some D-Rad pills. Yeah, they changed it in Skyrim. So Morrowind and Bolivian had similar skill systems. And then uh, Skyrim's when they switched it up. But uh, I, I was still a fan of the old style. All right, some more emails I got to get through. Greetings, Bridget. I'm not sure if this is your department, but I ran a full spectrum noise and analysis on our sector's communication network last week. I have strong evidence that there is leakage from our network, i.e. someone has gained external access. I'm happy to show you my data, or if not you, can you tell me who I should report this to? Thanks, Moria. Uh, good work. We'll take it from here. I can't access my files now. They're not... They found something they're not supposed to... As you know, we have had a bit of a rat problem throughout Cascade, and my team is working diligently to solve the problem. This was all going quite fine until we saw, quite literally, a rat appear out of thin air. Purple light and thunderbolts. I thought we had a gas leak for a moment, but we checked the security tapes. Look, we're perfectly capable of dealing with any rodent infestation on this planet, but if anyone is teleporting rats in from Universe 432718, or God knows where, that is another matter entirely. If anyone has any further information on where these rats are coming from, please let us know. Thanks, and best of luck with your science. Stanley Rain, janitorial supervisor. P.S. We caught one of the little fellows if anyone needs it back. Nice. Spelling. Gaston. We need to be consistent here. Once and for all, are we using US or British spelling? We're dealing with super powerful Ah, oh, this this person's got the uh they're like all like all about grammar. Otherworldly uh, artifacts and we can't even agree on a dictionary. Steven, it's spelt artifact. <laughs> Yeah, it's funny to see the scientists bickering. Uh, okay. Uh, you have to make bolts, though, which requires pens and metal scraps. Before I go down there, I'm going to take a peek over here. Oh, and uh, I put my radio away. I'll get a radio soon. Then you can talk to me while I'm out here doing this stuff. Son of a bitch, almost jumped me. I got my spear. Oh yeah, no, I understand. It's happened to me too. I actually know a trick to dealing with a lot of them. There's the death robot. I can get there soon enough. I just need to get through this stuff. Because I need to eat some rad pills because we had a... Oh, yeah. If you're near any radiation, uh, I left I a, a uh, rad cake. suit in the uh, armor bin. I also got food in the fridge and all that. I got battery backups, so I built some batteries. So when the power goes out around, I believe it's 6.30 p.m., then you'll still have power on a lot of those things. Yeah. It's, uh, it's literally a knife. It's literally just like a knife. 
So they put, it's a knife on the end of a stick, and they have weapon stuff. Uh, oh, it's probably that thing. I bet you that thing's like super strong with radiation. Yeah, it says right there, it emits extreme radiation. Gotcha. Uh, there's stuff in the fridge. Okay. Did the radiation go away? No. All right. Now it should go away when I take a pill. There we go. Now it's gone away. Give it to Godzilla. Yeah. Godzilla loves that stuff. All right. I'm going to put the potatoes. I'll put some potatoes in here. I can make some potato and sausage soup if I kill some aliens. If, as long as you're wearing the... Ra I found an exploit. All the food in there that says it's radiated, as long as you're wearing the rad suit, you can eat as much as you want. It doesn't make you sick. No way. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna be fucking huge. <laughs> That's why things like the uh, military stuff, you might as well keep that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And away you went. Teleported. Win. Yeah, if you eat the hearts. So the hearts are the alien hearts. When you eat them, they teleport you. I had one teleport me on top of the toilet. Oh, I was just like teleported God. and I was taking a shit. And I'm like, oh, okay. That's one way to make cement like railing in the middle of the main hallway. We can just walk around it and he can't get us. So he just keeps walking around the, the rail and we can keep hit getting him. So you're going to be taking shots at him as we're going up the hallway. I'm going to wake him up with my hammer. All right, he's pissed. Have fun. Keep shooting them. I'll take a shot. There. It's because you'll level up. As you're reloading and shooting, you'll start leveling up. That's why I don't want to take too many shots. Doo-doo-doo. All right. Look at that. I'll take care of any aliens if there's any aliens in here, but I do believe they're all gone. For the most part. Ooh, don't mind if I do. This is the thing right here, see? We can just walk around this. See how he has to tuck, turn, and come to us? And then you can just go to the other side. And see what I mean? And now when you're playing by yourself, you can cheese them by doing this stuff when you need CPUs and stuff. I'll uh, go to the end of the hallway so that he just chases you. You got this. Kiyoshi runs around the circle as the death bot chases them. I think they're going to win this. They have made them at least 50 crossbow bolts. Worst case scenario, they run out of those bolts and have to start whacking him. Careful, because that robot can falcon punch if you're too close, usually roughly about six feet away from him. So I'd be very careful and make sure that distance stays there. Well, as much as I'd love to say that, uh, Dester, is they are like level one. <laughs> so this robot will literally kick the crap out of them. And I'm just doing this so that they can level up their ranged. You got this. You got this. And it's going to take a while. So, like, be very generous with your shooting. Like, I'm, I'm talking, you're going to have to shoot that thing, like, 40 times. You might even run out of bolts before it's dead. 